Welcome back to Magic Tarot. This is Jasmine coming to you with a quick daily energy reading for all zodiac signs for May 14th, 2019. You have three cards here. The first one is the Eight of Wands, the Knight of Cups, and the Chariot. Okay, with the Eight of Wands, this card is um, a love card. So there's new love coming in for some of you. It could be an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. Um, <clears throat> this card shows... That you'll also have success in travel if you're planning on traveling to meet a new love or planning on traveling. Everything, uh, with this card, everything that you do is going to land in happiness and pleasure. Um, you're going in the right direction now. And you feel like you're going in the right direction. Um, there's progress in all your goals that you're trying to achieve, whether it be business, education, or relationship. Um, also, it shows there's a possible change in some type of environment that you're in. Um, <clears throat> so keep moving forward. This card suggests that your actions are, are right and keep moving forward with that. This is, I'm seeing a lot of love here because you also have the Knight of Cups. And I got this one earlier today in the reading for May 13th. Um, with the Knight of Cups, the horse means movement. This means movement. This is movement. And this is movement. So <clears throat> to, uh, May 14th is a good day to get engaged, to get married, to uh, move in a new direction as far as business, education, and relationship. A lot of you got um, engaged during the weekend. You see the horse? He's getting ready to cross over this this. Uh, river of love and he's holding the cup of love in his hands and he's offering you he's riding in slow and steady um <clears throat> cups represents pisces cancer or scorpio so someone of that zodiac sign could be offering you the cup of love and um it also can mean proposals you could have been proposed to or maybe you have a proposal in some type of education business or relationship this reading is almost the same as the one i did earlier today for for uh, May 13th um, there's a lot of love in the air and a lot of you are moving in that direction okay with the chariot this also is a travel card all these three are travel cards and love cards and success cards so this is actually a real good reading um, you see how he's riding in and he has no reins on these here he's controlling it just with him his own strength so this means success he's riding in successfully um it's showing that what whatever your goal is focused on you're going to have victory um you have the mental and physical stamina now and the inner strength to achieve your desired goal um, this card comes up a lot in relation to travel. So if you're on a journey, maybe you're going somewhere to get married or going somewhere to meet someone. Um, maybe a lot of you are going to go out of town and meet a new love interest. Um, and also shows that you have excellent health, the ability to overcome pretty much anything. Uh, maybe you were sick and now you're coming out of that. Again, I've been getting a lot of that this month where people were sick and now they're coming out of that, whether it be mental or physical or emotional. You're coming out of that. New things are moving in. Um, new love is moving in. For a lot of you, um, in the past few months, you, there was a lot of breakups and and uh, maybe you got let go of a job or someone let you go or you quit a job, but now things are moving forward. Um, tomorrow... Uh, this is for tomorrow, May 14th, is an excellent day to start something new. It's an excellent day to travel. It's an excellent day to get married, get engaged, and start a, start everything new. Start over. Okay? <clears throat> so the overall reading is actually really good. Um, new love interests coming, in relation to travels, education, business, new opportunities are coming. Um, somebody will be offering you some type of proposal, whether it be business, education, love. Accept that proposal, and it's going to land in success. Keep moving forward with that, okay? This is going to be short because it's one plain, simple 
message that's going across. If it resonates with you, that's wonderful. If it don't, come back for another reading. Um, after the 15th, I will do individual readings like I did before for each zodiac sign. Thank you for watching. Please come back and watch again. Please like, share, and subscribe. I would really appreciate it. Thank you so much, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.